It's been three years since I started working for this shopping mall in the countryside. Wataru, you've been doing it well lately. Thank you. I think I've got the hang of sales. Eureka Shiraishi talks to me with a smile. Her father runs the company that owns the shopping mall. She was an upper classmate of mine in high school. We're all counting on you. Talk to us any time you need our support. Yeah, thank you. They transfer me to another department every now and then, so I know most of the workers. Hey, do you have a second? Yeah, what's up? Could you help me carry some materials from the storage? Sure. I'll be back in a minute. Yeah. Everyone in all the departments relies on me. One day, I overhear an executive and a regular employee talking in a blind spot. Keep this a secret. You won't get promoted in our company unless you're married. Oh, really? We're in the countryside, and the demand for retail business is on decline. They want all the executives married so that they won't move out of town easily. And, you know, I hear that a big shopping mall will open here soon. Uh, I've heard that. You should change jobs with me. If you come with me, they'll give you a good position. Oh, their conversation causes me to think a lot about my career. What's wrong? You've been a little depressed lately. Sorry, I was lost in thought. Talk to me anytime you need help. I owe you a lot. Yeah, thanks. I spend my days without asking anyone for their advice. Hey, it's been a while! <laughs> Mimi? What are you doing here? I work at a consulting firm. I have a meeting here today. She's Mimi Nonohara, a lower classmate of mine in college. Her smile helps her leave an approachable impression. This is Horisugi. He's the sales manager. Nice to see you, Mr. Saijo. I often hear that you're competent. <laughs> I'm flattered. <clears throat> Why don't you transfer to my company? <clears throat> That's too sudden. You can't just recruit him right in front of me. He's important to my company. So beautiful. Huh? huh? I'm sorry, I was captivated. Are you seeing someone? I'm Horisugi. I'm Yurika Shiraishi. It doesn't matter whether or not I have a boyfriend. I'm sorry I surprised you. Yeah, we're here for business. I'll come back. We can talk further then. Huh? See you. Hey! We won't talk ever again. See you, Yukari. Oh... <sighs> I glanced at her back and it reminds me of an old memory. When I was in high school, Judo wanted me to join the club so badly. She drove them away from me. Thank you. They were really persistent. I've retired since I hurt my lower back. Are you still in pain? Kind of. I'm on my way to the nurse's office. Okay, let me walk you there. Thanks, but I'm fine. Don't worry. This is what a school council's president is for. She took good care of me until she graduated. I joined this company to repay her. What should I do? What are you doing tonight? I'm new in town. Give me a little tour. I need to know why they're aiming for my company. Okay, sure. This is how I decided to meet up with her. Mr. Horisugi is such a playboy. He hit on me too. Really? But this is my first time taking part in a big project. I can't blow this. I know you'll make it. Let me know if you need help. Thanks! Are you ready for a refill? Well, I should pace it out. We decided to part ways before I managed to hear any details of what's going on. Thanks a lot. I had a good time. Me too. Let me complain to you about my horrible boss again. Yeah, sure. Thanks. That's... <sighs> the next day. Morning. Uh, um, I have to go. Huh? Okay, sure. <clears throat> What's with her? It's rare for her to act unfriendly like that. I talked to her while we're on a break. Hey, do you have a second? Uh, yeah. Did I bother you in some way? Uh, I saw you walking with that girl last night. 
Uh, Mimi, right? You saw it? Actually, there's something I've been thinking about. <laughs> Why don't we go out for dinner tonight? You can tell me. Yeah, thank you. See you after work. See you. I meet up with her after work. Sorry for the wait. Uh, what's wrong? Um, you look different. I look weird? You're in a suit at all times, so... <laughs> Just kidding. Let's go. Y yeah We should order something first. Cheers. This is my first time grabbing a drink with her. I never knew that she easily gets drunk. Are you listening to me? Y yeah How come you call her by her first name? You two must be really close. Tell me. She was a lower classmate of mine in college. She wanted to complain to me about her boss. Hmm. So there's something you've been thinking about. Is it about the offer? Honestly, I'm wondering if I should take it. <laughs> I know why. It's better for your career to work at a bigger company. <laughs> I'm into my career. I want to get promoted and handle more various types of work. But it's not gonna happen unless I'm married, right? Huh? What makes you think that? I heard a rumor. I tell her what I overheard the other day. What do you think? That's not true. I recommended you to the top brass. So, you're gonna get promoted. Recommended me? Yeah, everyone in the company likes you. And you're reliable. I'm glad to hear that. I'm sorry for making you worry. There was this guy before you joined the company. He started bossing around after we told him about his promotion. So I wasn't allowed to tell you anything. Maybe the executives took advantage of that. I didn't know that. I wonder who started the rumor. What do they want? Are they recruiting people for the new shopping mall? Actually, we receive a suggestion that we sell our company. Really? Maybe it's out in the open. I'll look into it. Thanks. Okay, let's eat before the food gets cold. Yeah. Get married or no promotion. It's outdated. Do you want to get married? If you do, why don't we get married? What? Just kidding. Don't take it seriously. I know. Well, I wouldn't mind that if it's you. Did you say something? No, we should drink more. Y yeah We start grabbing a drink together after work to blow off some steam sometimes. A little while later, Horisugi visits us again. It's been a while, Yurika. Sun shining, birds chirping. It's a good day to get engaged. I'm sure I rejected you the other day. Oh, come on. You will regret it. <sighs> We're having a meeting. You should come. It's an important one. Of course I'm joining the meeting. Wataru, come with me. You should be there because it's almost decided that you'll be promoted. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is what you asked me for the other day. Thanks. No worries. As the meeting starts, Horisugi makes a speech proudly. I have a spy in this company. With the support of him, we've already acquired 30% of the stocks. I suggest to you all that your company come under our umbrella. If you resist, we'll buy more stocks and take over it. Oh no, that'll get everyone all worked up. Give us more time. Hmm. I like Yukari. Let me marry her. I'm the sales manager, so I can help you a lot. You can expand your business too. It's a sweet deal. We can't do that. Hold on. We don't have to sell our company. You're... Saicho. Everyone, take a look at the document. I started investigating this day after we grabbed a drink together. I found out who spread the false rumor. Check this one out too. We hired a private detective. We have a lot of evidence. What? How did you? It's a picture of Horisugi going into a hotel with the wife of the man who owns the new shopping mall. We have nothing left to talk about. They'll have to make up for hiring a person like you. Damn. How dare you? We set cameras in this room. Stay there or I'll call the police. 
What? I've already sent them all the evidence. You have no time to have a chat here. Uh, oh, President. Uh, no, it's... Yes, I'll be there. If it's possible. No, nothing. Horisugi's face is gray when he leaves the meeting room. A little while later, they investigated him more and found out everything he'd done. It caused him to lose his job. Of course, we fired the spy too. The man who owns the new shopping mall told the president to promote more people who aren't his family and turn our company around. The president agreed to that. Thank you so much. No worries. I feel secure with you. Could you get off me? Why? There's someone else I like. I'm gonna confess to her after I get promoted. So... What? Oh. Then, you're not dating her yet. There's no problem. We can't do this. Um, this is now how I was gonna tell you my feelings, but... Will you date me? I've always been in love with you. I was gonna do this after I became a man who'd suit you. I'm sorry. It's okay. I knew it. No. I'm sorry that I lied to you the other day. I said I was just kidding after I said, why don't we get married? I was not. I was serious. I thought it was too early for us, so I lied. You mean... It's a yes, of course. Let's go out for dinner and celebrate. You should come with us. Tell me how he was in college. Really? Thanks! You two easily get drunk. Don't drink too much. We, we can't, can't promise, promise anything. Several years later, as I get promoted to executive, I propose to Yukari. Mimi is into her career as a consultant. The three of us are still close and grab a drink together sometimes. I want to drink beer. That's no good for our baby. I know, I was just kidding. I made some hot milk for you. Thanks! Wataru, I'm really happy. Me too. We'll stay together forever. It's important to say thank you after someone helps you, especially if they're close to you. It'll help the bond forge. <laughs> <laughs>